um, I mean, you pastored New Life for 28 years. But 26, about 26, and you took over. <laughs> the, the, the grafting, I did. The grafting of business, best business practices, how would that flesh out for you just practically? Yeah. What would that look like? You read a book by yeah, yeah. someone and then what? Well, let's just take, even, let's just take mis- measure of success, you know, and I, I, you know, characteristics of uh, what's, what's that way? Well, standard planning and decision making, how it's done in churches. And I think I just naturally took it over, which was, well, success is more people, more numbers, something I can measure. So numbers, mm-hmm. so buildings, budgets, yeah. which isn't bad, you know, it's in the Bible, but that's such a narrow definition. Yeah. And I always struggled with that, right? I mean, Rich, we, if we want to go for numbers, we have to move. We should move out of this place, get a big parking lot, mm-hmm. leave the inner city of Queens, um, because it's going to inform then all your decisions. Yeah. So uh, that would be an example for me yeah. of, uh, or, or just making plans because we, we can do something, we do it because there's an opportunity, we just grab it, versus what's God's will for us? That's a different question to be asking. Yeah. And I think we go into planning meetings often led by someone who is skilled, who a Christian, who'd learned something from uh, that Procter & Gamble, General Electric, some excellent planning company outside. We'd bring them in, they'd lead us in a process. We'd pray to begin, we'd pray to end, maybe we'd pray at lunch. But I always felt like it's just, something is just not, Right. Yeah. And I, that unease or dis-ease persisted for many, many, many years, even as we got into EHS. But finally came to play saying, no, this, this, there's something wrong here. And I think we kind of fell into it slowly over time yeah. at New Life. Uh, but it was, a, it, it was like breaking a paradigm yeah. that I felt like I was immersed in since I became a Christian. Yeah.